Um, I get questions sometimes about my jacket and where I get patches and such things. So uh, I wanted to share. So yeah, um, let me show you. This is my jacket. You could have your own jacket too. Um, you can get patches on eBay, Etsy, um, you know, wherever, at shows, wherever you want to get them. Um, you can even make them yourself. I've made a couple of them. Let me just show you here. Okay. This is actually... My mom got these for me. They're like Umbreon eyes. Um, I have an Umbreon tattoo here. <laughs> you can go see my tattoo video if you want to know more about that. But yeah, my mom got me these and I just put them right on the top here. I think they're super cute. What was that? Hold up. As I was saying, I think they're super cute. So, okay. This, okay, this Life's Not Out To Get You is a Neck Deep thing. If you guys know that pop punk band, Neck Deep, I had a t-shirt of theirs and I eventually kind of cut it up to kind of change it. It kind of turned out a mess. I made it into like a little crop top and it just, I don't know, I don't really wear it, but I cut this off of it and then I just sewed it right on here and I think it makes a really nice little patch. Um, and I also made this, this Bring Me the Horizon one. I think I just took like black fabric from like, I don't know, old jeans or like, I can't really tell what fabric exactly it is, but then I just went in with like a fabric pen or like a, you know, like a graffiti pen, art pen type thing. Just did the little Bring Me the Horizon, um, that's the spirit album symbol. I love the, the little rainy shit too. I love rain, so this has like a double meaning because I'm just obsessed with rain in general. Um, now let's see, let's see. Um, Fiddler, I think I got this on Etsy. Um, Johnny Hobo and the Freight Trains, I think Etsy. Um, this Neck Deep generic pop punk patch. Where did I get this? I either got this from like the official Neck Deep website or I got it on like eBay or something but either way I think it's like an officially official neck deep patch rather than like a fan made thing. Ah this is falling off a little bit pretty bad. Um, I sew all my patches on some people like to iron them but I don't know I just I know how to sew so that's just <clears throat> sorry that's just always how I did it. Um, I have this Bring Me the Horizon special pizza pizza patch. I don't remember when I got this, but I think this is relatively new-ish. Bring Me the Horizon, and then it has a pizza, and then their little symbol that they always do. Um, I thought that was super cute. I love pizza too, so I had to get that. Um, okay, System of a Down up in here. Anti-flag, no effects. Bring Me the Horizon again. Um, I think these were all like eBay or like Etsy or something. And then Slipknot, this was from a, uh, a t-shirt that I had. I just cut that off and put it right on there. Um, it was a t-shirt that I had altered a few different times. Like I cut the sleeves off. Um, at one point I, I let a lot of people wear it just for fun. I, that shirt went through a lot. So I, I cut off the, uh, the, it was just a plain black and it just said Slipknot. So I just, I wanted to keep it, so I cut it off and put it on here. Um, I think this was also from that Neck Deep t-shirt that I was talking about. I think that was on there too. I just cut that off and put it on here. Um, this I made Only Posers Die from SLC Punk. I also have a tattoo that says Only Posers Die. Um, yeah, check out my tattoo video if you want to know more about that. Uh, Metallica, Ride the Lightning Patch. I think that's from like eBay or something, I don't know. Um, so yeah, I haven't really gotten these patches at shows, which some people don't really like that. You're supposed to like collect patches when you go to shows and such, but 
I don't know, you can't always afford to go to a show and you can't always afford to spend that extra money on a patch. Like, I don't know, sometimes you'd rather have a t-shirt. Um, or sometimes you just don't like the patch art that they're selling at the time. So, I don't know, I, I should do that more though. I should, um, <clears throat> I do go to kind of a lot of shows, but if I get something, I'll usually get a t-shirt just because I really like t-shirts. Um, I feel like I can never have enough band t-shirts, but I should definitely work a little bit more on getting patches because this is all I have right now and I think I've had this jacket for quite some time. Um, so yeah, this is my, oh yeah, I got this uh, suicidal tendencies thing too. I think that was from Etsy, but yes, um, this is my patches jacket. Some would call it a battle jacket. You probably can't call it that if it's not like metal. You know what I mean? I don't think I have very much metal on here other than like that and that. Um, and I don't know, old Bring Me the Horizon, I guess. But not the new Bring Me the Horizon. That is not metal. Anyways, if you want to make your own jacket, just start collecting patches from anywhere like cut them out of t-shirts that you don't wear anymore um order cheap ones on ebay etsy whatever um you know like go to shows and get them that's the authentic way i guess um or make them yourself you know get out the fabric markers cut out little pieces of fabric from clothes that you don't want anymore and yeah, it's pretty easy. If you don't know how to sew, it's pretty easy to learn, I think, probably. I don't know, I learned when I was really young, but there's probably, like, YouTube videos on it. Um, but, of course, like, it's not foolproof. These things do come off. I should probably re-sew this. Um, some people iron their patches. I don't know anything about that, really. Um, I feel like that would be a greater risk of falling off. Whereas sewing's kind of on there, except it's not sometimes, obviously, because, like, hello, what is this? Um, but yeah, I really like this jacket. I really like collecting, like, little pieces of me and, like, putting them on here. It's like, this jacket is just, like, a bunch of me, things I like. Um, and yeah, of course, like, you don't have to do just music, you don't have to do just metal, like, or just punk, you know, just, like, put whatever you like on it. I have my Pokemon-related stuff, I have movie-related stuff, mostly bands, but, you know, put, like, literally whatever you want on it, because you just, you know, it's all about having fun and just chilling, and, yeah. Don't judge me, metalheads, for my jacket. <laughs> and yes, um, that is what I have, and I love it. Hell yeah. You should make one too, if you want to. Um, if you have any questions, just leave them down below. Maybe there was something I failed to answer in this video. Um, if you want to know more about making your own or anything, just hit me up in that good old comment section and yeah I want to put so much more on here um, I've just been like slacking but I gotta get to it all right <laughs> um, have a good day leave a comment subscribe if you want and I'll see you next week <laughs>